The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden Coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is up, guys? Man in the yellow hat here, back with another Madden 17 Ultimate Team video. No, I'm just joking, guys. It is Clickwood, as you probably know. Guys, what we're going to be doing today is taking a look at the brand new, most feared items that are in the game today. It is Halloween, which means, yes, I am in costume, kind of. It's kind of a real basic costume, but I'm having fun today. I'm wearing the Man in the Yellow Hat costume because my daughter is a huge Curious George fan. We're going to go trick-or-treating tonight a little bit. She's only two years old, so we're only going to hit maybe five, six houses around the neighborhood, people that we know, uh, and, you know, it should be kind of fun. So I'm dressed as Man in the Yellow Hat. She's obviously Curious George. We're going to have a lot of fun. We'll probably post some pictures on Twitter. I, uh, if you guys don't follow me, you should probably follow me because I have some fun on Twitter troll people post random pictures of me and my daughter that kind of crap but anyway guys uh, what we're doing today like I said is taking a look at the new most feared items that got added there are some nasty cards they're also obviously team of the weeks that got added today because it is Monday so the first thing that I want to show you guys is one of the craziest cards that they have put into the game this year and that is the brand new JJ Watt most feared item take a look at this thing boys 93 overall look at that card art he's screaming he's looking like a beast absolutely awesome card guys really great combination of speed rushing as well as like being able to stop the run all of those types of things that you would look for in a defensive end this jj watt can do it he is a freaking monster right now guys this is a crazy op card and it is definitely one of the best players currently in the game right now. It's going for, what, 800,000 coins at minimum right now? Looks like there's one up for about 750,000. So that's the cheapest right now that I've seen. Uh, so definitely a very, very good card. I wouldn't be surprised if this gets sold here in the next couple of minutes. Now, in addition to the JJ Watt, there is also Team of the Week items that got added to the game. Like I said before, the best one of the bunch is DeMarco Murray. It's good to see him finally get the card that he deserves this year. He is having a beast of a season for the Tennessee Titans. Miss him on the Cowboys, although I have to say my Cowboys being 6-1 and one, looking pretty good right now with Ezekiel Elliott and Dak Prescott. Nice to have Des Bryant back. We got some injuries on defense, but hopefully we can continue that streak that we're going on right now. I think that's six straight wins for my boys. But again, DeMarco Murray is a freaking beast, guys. This is a great combination running back. A lot of the guys that you'll see in this game are either kind of speed backs or else they're power backs. But I really like DeMarco Murray because he brings both of these aspects. He's got 90 speed and 90 trucking. He still has great agility. The juke move is solid. The carrying is good. Everything that you would look for in a running back, this thing has. It also has the chain mover chemistries and the bruising back chemistries if you want to add put those onto the team as well. So very, very nice cards. Couple other ones that they added to the game today, guys. We got a new Des Bryant. We got a new Bradley Roby. So that's nice. Nice to have those guys back. Uh, Tyler Eifert got a card as well. Derek Carr is also uh, one of the. He, he's actually the offensive hero. I'm not sure if anybody's completed that yet. I'm assuming probably a couple people have. Uh, yes, I believe this one is it. So, yeah, that, take a look at that card, man. 90 overall, pretty damn nice. 84 speed on him as well, so that's a pretty nice thing to have for a quarterback at this point in the season. Not a lot of guys have that 84 speed along with nice throwing attributes, which, as you can see from Derek Carr, he definitely has. He hit, he hit over 500 yards passing on Sunday, so definitely deserving of the team of the week. Good to see him. And then my boy Sean Lee. Also got uh, a team of the week this year. He is the defensive hero, and this guy definitely deserves it, man. I was saying during the game last night, I haven't seen him play any better. He sniffed out a couple of plays on third and short that could have definitely changed the momentum of that game and given the Eagles a win, and it was all Sean Lee, man. Like, one guy, one man wrecking crew just running straight through the defensive line, crushing him in the backfield. He forced a sack. I mean, he did all. He did everything that you would look for out of a beast linebacker. So it's definitely cool to see Sean Lee getting some upgrades here. Uh, and also, of course, Des Bryant, if you're a Cowboys fan. Uh, it's great to see the new J.J. Watt because it's kind of crazy that we're not going to see any more J.J. Watts this year as far as like Team of the Weeks and things like that because he isn't playing, obviously, this season. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it's definitely crazy that we've got all this stuff going on right now in Madden 17 Ultimate Team. 
I'm very excited about it, man. I hope that we're going to be able to pull something decent today because we are going to open up some packs. I am going to open up both of these most feared team of the week packs that I can pull with coins. And we're also going to rip open some pro, uh, some standard pro packs. So what we're going to do first is we're going to open up one most feared team of the week pack. But guys, if you don't know this, it does guarantee you one most feared player as well as two team of the week players, which means it could be DeMarco Murray. It could be JJ Watt. And we could also get some of the other beastly most feared players. So I'm definitely excited for this. We're probably not going to get anything because that's just how Madden is this year. But it only takes that one time to really hit it big, man. So, all right, let's go ahead and do it here. We're going to open up one of these and then we'll rip one at the end as well. So the first card out of it is an Angelo Blackson. All right, Willie Young. Let's get some good stuff coming in. Ryan Matthews. Come on. Let's go. Elites. We need elites, baby. We need elites. Come on. Jamison Crowder, Team of the Week. Is that even from this week? I think it is because he did have a great game. Yeah, it is. Week 8, Team of the Week, Jamison Crowder. He is a new one as well. Come on. Caleb Jackson. Dwayne Allen. Still haven't gotten our other card. There it is. A most feared Cordero Patterson. So, unfortunately, this is kind of one of the more mediocre ones that I could have pulled. But that's okay. And we do get also an AJ McCarron as well. Um, nice card there uh, for like the preseason anyway, but definitely not anything that's worth any coins at this point, unfortunately. So I didn't even realize that these ones you could still pull. So that's kind of unfortunate. I thought it was all going to be the ones from this week. But anyway, let's go in here and rip a couple of pro packs. See if we can get anything going with those. Oh crap. We almost pulled a, a fright pack. I don't want to do that right now. Those things are way too damn expensive in my opinion. All right, let's go. Let's get some stuff going, man. And also, guys, I want to hear from you. Are you guys going as anything for Halloween, or is it just me? Am I the only dork right now that's dressed up? Is anybody else out there going to do anything for Halloween tonight? I know some of you guys are a little bit younger. If you are, let me know in the comment section what you're dressed up as. Or uh, if you're a, a parent or something like that. Hey, we got a random Mike Singletary collectible. I will definitely take that. If you're a parent, let me know what your kids are going for as well. Uh, going as I should say so we got what three elites in this or three golds in this pack That's kind of crazy like we got the mark ingram there. We got the uh, Lamarcus joiner and then we also got the uh, mike singletary collectible. So that's definitely a pretty nice pro pack I will definitely take that but Yeah, i'm interested to know man because uh, it feels like halloween just doesn't have the same type of hype to it this year As it has in previous years and it might just be because i'm getting older I mean i'm excited to go out with my daughter, but like I don't hear a whole lot about it uh, I don't know. Maybe it's just my friends aren't having big parties and things like that like we used to I I don't know but we get a Danny Woodhead in that pack so yeah I mean it just it kind of feels like Halloween's just kind of um I don't know like it, it exists I guess but maybe there's like this weird fear this year because of like the the whole um like the clown thing that's going on out there and by the way that stuff is so preposterous like who the hell dresses up like a clown to scare people like what a weird thing to do. I don't actually really have a fear of clowns any more than I would any other person coming at me with a weapon. But, uh, yeah, I mean, that would definitely freak me out if somebody was coming at me with, like, a giant mallet or something like that and, like, chasing after me. I'd be like, what the hell is going on? Or, like, r sprinting toward me with a mallet dressed all crazy. That would probably freaking freak me out. Or they've got, like, a, I've seen some ones where it's, like, a chainsaw. I kind of think that stuff is kind of rare. I haven't really seen a whole lot of that going on. It kind of seems like people are faking it for Vine. Hey, we got a random kicker elite. Like, what? I, <laughs> that's that's a nice pull, I guess. I mean, it's probably a, a, one of the better kickers that you can pull. So, yeah, I mean, definitely uh, happy to pull that over just a standard crap card. So, yeah, all right. We, it's a kicker elite, but we'll take it. It's an elite nevertheless. All right, continuing on here. But guys, let me know too, uh, are you guys, what, what is your opinion on the whole clown thing? Because like, I kind of, like I said, I kind of feel like it's just getting kind of overblown a little bit. We got three golds out of this one as well, two 72s, and then we get the 82 as well for Janora Cersei. So yeah, again, let me know, what do you guys think about the whole clown thing? Is it freaking you out? Are you guys worried at all? I'm I'm not really worried at all. I mean, if, if a clown run up on me, he's going to catch this punch, you know what I'm saying? So <laughs> I'm not really that worried about it. We get a Carlos Williams out of this pack. We'll do two more pro packs, guys, and then we'll rip open that last uh, Team of the Week pack that we can do. So we're way below now our million coins. I think we started off with well over a million coins to start this pack opening, but that's all right. I mean, we'll still have plenty of coins at the end of this video. And we got some decent stuff out of here. Nothing really spectacular, but a couple of decent things as we pull a couple of golds here out of this pack. One more pro pack. 
and then we'll move on to that other pack. So let's go, man. We need some we need some luck here. I still got 550 points, too. I almost forgot about those, but that'll be good for a future pack opening video anyways. Come on, son. Let's do this. Let's do this. We get an Eddie Lacy. Crap. Garbo Ed Eddie Lacy. Trash. All right, man. We got one final most feared team of the week pack, guys. Wish me some luck. 70,000 coins. Probably going straight down the shitter. But what are you going to do? All right, Kendall Wright is the first card. I'm kind of surprised, by the way, that Kendall Wright hasn't gotten any upgrades. He's had a couple of pretty good games this year. Derek Carr, could you troll me more? I know you can't pull Derek Carr, but still. All right, Tim Hightower. He actually, I think, got a team of the week this week. He did. Yeah, because uh, my boy Mark Ingram completely screwed me in my fantasy league against d -Coop. Uh, he came in and fumbled on like his first or his second carry and just killed me. He ended up getting negative points because they benched him after that. Tim Hightower came in. We get a Zach Streif there for our most feared card. Matt Clear. We've got still one more team of the week, I believe. And here it is. It's an elite. And it is a star Latulale. All right. I will definitely take that. It's only an 86 overall, but uh, definitely nice to pull the elite. I am very, very happy about that. So we get an Elite from this week. That's pretty damn cool. Very nice. We get that Elite pull. Very happy to see that. So we'll have to see what this thing's going for. I'm, I imagine it's got going for a whole ton right now. But we could definitely go in there and take a look. So, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy to pull that anyway. I know it's definitely not going to make up for the amount that I spent here. But it's worth taking a look at. So we'll see what this thing's going for here. Newest... Uh, out of the elites, and we get the Star Latulule. What is he going for? What's this card going for right now? Like 10,000? Oh, snap. It's going for like oh, 12,000. <laughs> Terrible. Whatever, man. It's still better than nothing anyway. So, anyway, guys, that is going to do it for this video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please do me a favor and drop a like on it. And don't forget to let me know what you guys are doing for Halloween. If you're dressed up as anything, if you want, tweet me a picture. I'll hit you with the retweet if it's something decent anyway. If it's just like you dressed up wearing like a t-shirt or something, what are you doing? You know what I'm saying? Hit me up with your uh, Halloween stuff, guys. Thanks again. Hope you enjoyed the video. Drop a like. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll talk to you guys again soon.